my boy Mike is starting his what first day. So I'm real, I'm real excited for that. I'm real proud of him, man, because me and Mike, we've known each other since like five years old. Real good dude, real, real ambitious, real hungry dude. I think he's gonna do real good in the, in the barber industry. He's gonna kill it. I'm just excited to see him grow, man. So you see Mike today. It looks like, as far as the bar, the new barber shop goes, we're gonna be opening like, hopefully like around September 21st in that area. And you know, I, I'll be I'll be recording and stuff, vlogging whenever I'm working on that, I'm showing you guys what I'm doing. Uh, me and my business partners. My boy eating food. What you eating? Nah. Italian beef. Oh really? Let me see what you got over here, Mike. What you get? What you get? Uh, what you get? Let me see. Uh, my Show the camera. Show the people. The people want to see. Nigga, can you blog somewhere else? The people want to <laughs> see. The people. <laughs> I got on my finger on this It's disgusting, bro. It's black? I can't, I can't see. It's metallic. Now I'm going to have to edit it, oh, no, this but shit. It's not. Be, because you're making me it's look bad. It's metallic color. It's um. It's very nah, it's, like a, it's a weird color. It's actually pretty. It's metallic. It's gum metal. Gum metal. Gun that metal, shit is dope, go. bro. Let me get that. Damn, yeah, almost best. Dude, almost you best almost kissed me, man. <laughs> Just move back a little bit. Give me some space. Did somebody say gun? Somebody say gun? Oh, okay. that shit don't even look like a gun. <laughs> that shit look like a bazooka. <laughs> All right, somebody said the gun show. like a fucking leg. <laughs> Did someone say the bazooka? They might. You caught the what's it? MDT one. Yeah. Two gun boy. You see what it look like on there? Like a like a gun metal. That's weird. The whole thing's right there. So we're over here making a video for you guys. Just a heads up. Making a video for y'all. My cameraman, Big Mike, what up? There's a setup. And yeah, we in the shop making a video for y'all. When it's slow, you gotta take advantage of the slow time, your downtime. It's easy to be in the bar. You're in the downtime, you can do other things. Today, Elijah got to spend the whole day with Daddy. Right, Papa? Mm -hmm. You have fun with Daddy today? Mm -hmm. Will you look up and say hi? Hi. You have fun, right? Yeah. We had a lot of fun today. He hung out with me at the shop. Even though it was busy, he had the iPad and everything ran smoothly. So, good day overall. One of the perks of being a barber. You can, have, you can make it uh, kids there at work all the time. Daddy and Daddy and Sunday at work. Sorry. Not even in here. So, um, we're at Headline Barbershop and um, we're uh, trying to make videos uh, of like dopest haircuts in Tampa. And this is uh, the owner of this barbershop. His name is Chris Basio. And um, yeah, that's about it. Um, and this is an Asian uh, trying to learn how to speak Spanish. Uh, he doesn't even know how to say disculpe. Uh, it actually means I'm sorry. What? Drinking or Asian. Egg roll and disculpe. You got a straw? And then I give him that I take all his money. Mine for vlogging. Gotta get this. The Mushu spray. Nice, love it. Introducing the barbers at Headlines Barbershop. This is Alex the barber. This is this is John the barber. This is levels to this the barber. Yo man, screw your blog, yo, everything you talk. Hey, check me out, yo, Yeah, my channel, yo. This is Philly, uh -huh. number one client. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is Nate the barber. Stand up, baby. This is Cidito the barber. The Puerto Rican Asian cat. <laughs> Wait. Look. And this is Kevin the barber. What? Comedian's good. 
guy is cutting his own hair, working in a barber shop. <laughs> See? Right here we have a North American Chris Borsky cutting his own hair. And I'm going to be a commentator for this video here. So first, he starts off with a, what guard is that, sir? Mate. That's a number five. And he's going all around his head, just getting down the bulk right now. That's a good creature. <laughs> Ugly ass nigga, y'all. I got you on my phone, the Bradley Cooper. I don't know why, bro. Wow, bro. <laughs> you know what? You suck. I'm a man to start That's fine, man. Let my grandmother, bro. Oh, so good. Yeah. You know it's music right now. Without the wisdom. Oh, shit. Damn, man. What a no! Oh, you vlogging? You vlogging? Okay. 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 Oh, I'm not Just gonna. the inside. You don't have to say anything. You don't have to say anything. It's already recording. Let's do it. These guys just sit down. Sorry, say hi. He's ordering food, he don't count. Say hi, Mike. Hey, say hi. So, this is an interview um, to see how you feel when you get a fresh cut from your barber, uh, Chris Basio. Um, so, how do you feel when you get a nice cut? Uh, well, right now, you know, when I'm when my hair's like, you know, rolled up, I feel like crap. You feel like crap? Well, the way it is now, though, right? I'm a new man, because I know Christopher Basio is like the best barber in town. Oh. Yeah, so I'm when your hair is all ugly and nasty, you feel like crap, correct? Yeah. yeah. So now, after you get out of the barbershop and you yeah. get a nice haircut, how do you feel? I feel like a new man. Like I, a new I man? I finally feel more secure now. And so that's how Chris Basio makes you feel after a haircut, right? That's a good explanation. That's a good explanation. Thank you again, Chris. So Chris, how do you feel when you, you hear comments like this from your clients that, you know, you changed their lives by just a simple haircut? I feel fulfilled. I feel like if I'm doing so much, then he shouldn't come in here with gel in his hair. I agree. Yeah. Alright, so we're here with Philly Flavor. Bringing the Philly and the flavor. Philly Flavor. Philly Flavor. Philly Flavor. Did you like it? Yeah. You said how much? Alright, well. <laughs> if I'd have known all this, my GoPro's in the truck. I did not feel my eyes. Who wants racing stripes? You believe I went nowhere? Nobody can see. Nowhere at shaving town? No razor blades for the. The, 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 the,
411. So I'm doing double the work right now. Mm -hmm. That's what these niggas are doing in three minutes. We're at six minutes. Six minutes? Barber problems. Yeah. Right there. Now we get. Man, get it. Get that. <laughs> oh my god, we got, we got, we got. Alice learning how to use. I don't think it'd board. be easier if your heels were like flush with the back of it, not hanging off. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it makes sense. Oh my God! We got him on deck. We got him on deck. This could be like a cell phone. You never know, bro. With the bags. We live in a lazy generation, man. Whoa, 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 that's what I'm talking about. That was the smallest fall in the world. It's all like, all like slow motion fall. No, but the thing is, there wasn't a lot of distance between him and the ground. So it, was, it wasn't that epic. Alright. Okay. Alex said. Kev's been riding this a little bit longer, so he's a little bit more. We just got him, but Kev's been riding him about 10 minutes. Like, you know, shoes, like, yeah, yeah, shoes, Chris? I mean, okay. It's gotta be a position, like an easier so way to go. Like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, you're right. Yeah, that, that does feel better. Kev's killing y'all right now, bro. Relax, bro, relax. Alright, that does feel better. Damn, Kev got it. Boys, oh my god. And it matches you. It's, Yo, Phil, you it matches over, your man? outfit. I'll be, I picked up today. Oh, Phil, you gotta get on, bro. Yeah, so. We gotta get Phil <laughs> on this day, bro. Whoa, that thing is dope. That's it, we sweeping on that thing now. <laughs> it's gonna sweep. Alright. This is your fix if you if you're sick of always sweeping, taking forever to sweep. This is the fix right here. Nice. <laughs> Hey, feel like a zombie. Hey, walking dead. Hey, Phil, do, Phil's doing better than Alex. Six bottles. No blood over here. It's safe to say nobody needed more help than JP on this thing. Oh, 
<laughs> you can barely go forward. I'm doing better than me, bro. Now squat it like this. Like this, huh? But take a doobie to poop. Trying to teach these guys how to do like those guys, but. John, you gonna go? You gonna move or anything? I get no fans. Loser. He'll bother up. Put your foot bother up. There you go. Act like he's standing like in the middle of a plank or something. Come on. God, I just wanted to fall so bad. Oh, that nigga like he was about to jump. Oh, you look way better now, bro. Yeah, you look like an old man before you. Whoa, 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 relax, Chris. That nigga head keep on balance. Yeah. Oh, there goes. Best way to advertise. Right off the highway. You gotta be creative, man. You gotta stand apart. Right off Del Mabry. My boy's on the hoverboard. Flex. Already. Look at the boss. You got the boss working. You got the boss working. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see if you get that beep. Do the spin, ugly. So I, I just got done cu cutting a bunch of, um, I just got done cutting hair. Um, I said in my appointment book some time so I can make it to my son's boxing. Um, he's doing training on Mondays and Thursdays, Mondays and Wednesdays now. So on Wednesdays I take a little break from the shop, run over to my son's gym, and I'm just there to support him. That's one of the things about being an entrepreneur, being my boss, being a barber. Set your schedule that way to work with my clients. Now it's, uh, you know, I got an hour to be here and then I gotta run over to my, back to the shop to my next appointment. Right here, pop, 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 yeah. Right here, pop, one, two, slip, so many closer. Right here, one, two, slip, slip, pop, yes, sir. You gotta keep your feet down the ground, ready? Go. One, two, slip, pop. Barber living the lavish life. All he's missing is palm trees and a pina colada. <laughs> Should I pour him a beer? Pour him a beer, bro. Pour him a beer. <laughs> what happens when you get a self-bouncing scooter in the shop? It's part of the experience now. <laughs>